Hello, I'm Kate and welcome to this video. It's a huge Home Bargains haul. So I've got loads of different things to show you that I found in Home Bargains earlier on this week. So I've got all sorts from toiletries to outdoor things, things for the garden, some beautiful mirrors that are um, were such a bargain. I couldn't believe it when I found them. And um, some garden toys, just loads of different things, basically. It's just a huge kind of huge haul with all kinds of different things. So I hope you're okay, sending love to everyone and happy Friday, happy weekend if you're watching it over the weekend. You might be able to hear Rufus the dog, he's on the bed having a little snore, but I don't think it's gonna to be too loud. You might be able to hear him in the background. Um, but before I get into all my um, home bargains goodies, I've got to do my mug of the day and I haven't used this one in ages actually. It was just sat there and I thought, oh, that's a that's a nice one for the weekend. So um, I thought I would use this lovely mug. It's a Ray Dunn mug. And I found this in TK Maxx a couple of years ago, I think, and it was only two quid and I bought two of them. I can't remember what the other one says. It says something else. But um, yeah, I love these mugs. I love the different shapes of them. Well, the shape of this one, because it's all sort of a bit dentity, isn't it? Love it. So this is my mug of the day. I've got a caramel coffee. So I'm going to start off with some of these, which I thought looked really good. I've not seen these before. Um, these are excellent for like you only get hay fever lee gets hay fever really badly my other you know other my partner lee um i was gonna say my other half but he's just, i don't know i never know what to say because we're not married yet and by the way a few people were asking um if we're getting married this year and we're not because of everything going on we had to postpone it from last year to this year and then we're just postponing it to whenever we'll see what happens so maybe next year but i'll keep you posted i'll do a bit of a life update at some point and you know tell you more about that but yeah back to these so lee gets Hey Viva, and so do I, but not so bad this year. Um, so these are just, they're called Allergy Comfort Water Fresh Wipes. Instant refreshing feeling, wipes away allergens. You know, sometimes you get so, when I've had hay fever in the past, you get so itchy and irritable. It's quite nice to have a wipe that you could use um, on your face. And this is for the nose and around the eyes. So these are for Lee really, because like I said, I've not been too bad with my hay fever, which is brilliant. It's got a really bad one when I was younger. And it just says sensitive cleansing um, with 99% pure water anytime, anywhere. So I'll definitely take these camping because um, these would be great for then. Uh, yeah, so these were 99p, I'm pretty sure. I don't need to check that. I know they're 99p. So that's the first thing. And then, oh yeah, Lee was with me when we went shopping and he picked up a couple of things like these light bulbs. Apparently they're a really good price. So I think these were 3 dollars Oh, where are they? No, it's not the rounder set. That's coming up. Oh, there we go. Yeah, three ninety nine for these, for the four pack, and they're warm white. So he said that was a really good price. So he picked that up, and he also got this um, camping mallet thing, a rubber mallet, and I think this was eighty nine p. So this is just to hit your tent pegs in, isn't it, when you go um, camping? And then I got some of this Mrs Hinch flash spray stuff. This is um, antibacterial wild berries, spray white hinged. Now, if you watch my videos, you know I'm not the best at cleaning, but I do like to clean my surfaces and, and try and, you know, be as clean as I possibly can. I don't love cleaning. I wish I did, but I just don't. I find it really boring, but you obviously have to be clean and stuff, so you have to do it. And this is um, just as multi-surface 800 milliliters spray, and I bet that smells nice. And Mrs. Hinch says, all the best. Thank you, Mrs. Hinch, how lovely of you. That was one ninety nine. Pretty sure that was one ninety nine. if I can find it on here. It's a lot to look at. I hope you've, hope you've got a bit of time set aside. Um, yeah, one ninety nine. where is it? Oh, there, I found it, one ninety nine. yay. And I got a couple of deodorants. I know these were 99p or a pound, and I really like the smell of them. I found a lovely deodorant the other day with rose in it, like, you know, the rose scents in it. And, um, I saw these and thought they're going to be lovely as well. So I think the key to smelling nice is getting a, a good deodorant that actually smells really fresh. And I just love the look of them. I'm going to be using a lot of deodorant because it's getting warmer. So these are Dove Nourishing Secrets Limited Edition, refreshing summer ritual with aloe vera and rose water scent, 0% alcohol. So that looks really nice. What does that say? Building girl self-esteem inspired by rituals of Mexican women. That's interesting. Yeah, it says it on the back as well. Okay, so yeah, two of them, 150 milli, milli, what? millimetres, millilitres in each one. So that'll keep me nice and fresh. And then we're going to be going camping soon and going to be outdoors a lot more. So I bought some of this um, fly repellent. Hang on, I need a bit of coffee. One sec. 
fly repellent stuff. This is brilliant. So I used to see it years ago. I think, oh, that can't be very good. And it's actually all I've used. I think I bought the jungle one a couple of times, but this is really good. Like I hardly ever get bitten um, when I use this and I just kind of put it around my ankles, backs of my legs and then backs of my arms because I find they're the most bitten places. So yeah, I bought two of those because they were sold out last time I tried to look for it. I haven't actually been to Home Bargains in a while, so it was great being back there. Um, these are 120 millilitres each, and I think they're £1.49. And then I got a smaller one, and this one is DEET free. So that's for kids, so Toby can use this one. That was 99p, but these are really good. Honestly, so if you're looking for like a, a good fly spray, mosquito and insect repellent, so I've got things all around me, then I think they're really good. I also picked up some... Um, eyelash curlers because I'm using them a lot at the moment I used to always get my eyelashes done I used to get them extended if so if you've like been around and watched my channel for a while I used to always have those eyelash extensions but they um I love them but they're obviously quite expensive and uh they wrecked my lashes because I had them on for too long I should have had breaks and stuff but I didn't so then when lockdown happened I didn't get them again so I've just been curling my eyelashes and they're coming back I think they're a lot better now than they were so well done eyelashes for coming back and then I just give them a little curl and use mascara so these were 99p each so hopefully they're good and then what have I got next some ah, plasters which you always need plasters oh where are these I don't know they've got to be about a pound haven't they oh there we go 149 that's quite a lot but they are a last plus a last of plast so that's a really good make I normally don't buy the expensive uh makes but I think it was an offer I don't know you get 12 in there probably could have got more for my money but I've got those now and then I got some toothpaste I love this toothpaste this is my favorite toothpaste and these are quite expensive I think these were actually 2 99 but they're really good so when I don't use it I can feel the difference like when I use it all the time I love it so this is Oral-B 3D white glamorous glamorous white um I don't know why I did that for glamorous um the smooth whitening 100 millilitres enamel safe toothpaste and they are I think they're 2.99 yeah 2.99 each so a little bit more expensive but I think it's worth it because it's so good and then I've got some simple wipes these were £1.29 and they are biodegradable wipes which is brilliant I think most now are biodegradable which is brilliant clear and matte cleansing wipes daily skin detox um just says for oily blemish prone skin so yeah I get quite oily skin which I don't really mind as I've got older I used to hate it when I was young I used to hate like having oily skin but I don't mind so much now um and then it just says it mattifies so it's kind of good so hopefully um I don't know I don't mind I don't mind me oily skin but I thought well I'll try it you know I'll try them and hopefully they'll be good uh and they were cheaper than the other ones that's why I went for them as well I think they were £1.29 this looks really nice bubble tea oh it's a bit bright there Bubble tea pear bath salts for the bath only. Don't eat or drink it. And just looks really nice. I do love having a bath. I actually haven't had a bath in a while, a few weeks, but I will do. Um, and use this. And um, I've got quite a few. I've used quite a few of these bubble tea products. And you can always find them in home bargains. And they're just really nice and really like the smells are amazing. You get 500 grams in there. And I think they were 150 bubble tea. There we go. £1.49 which is really good isn't it so yeah some bath salts and then I've got some tissues I've totally run out of all my tissues I had loads in my cupboard in the kitchen and then I couldn't find any the other day so I've got some tissues and I think these were 69p uh, where are you on here there you go oh Kleenex no that's the um that's the um face wipes I think they were 69p Ah, can't find them. Oh, well, but they're tissues. They're always in there and they are the cheapest ones that home bargains do. And then I've got some fire lighters. These are really good. So when we go camping, we'll have like our fires in the evening. And I think these are 49p each. I think they used to be cheaper. They're at the bottom of my receipt, 49 pence each. Yeah, which is still a really good price. And you get 24 in there. But I just break off a little chunk when I like fires, you know, in our like log burners at home or, um, you know, when you do a fire outside or something and you know when you go camping you have your little fire pit um and then i've got some citronella candles these were 69 pence each they had a few different colors so if you didn't want yellow they had um some other color pots and then you can use these once you've burnt the candles you can use these and put a little plant in it or something can't you or 
use them for your toothbrushes or something. So yeah, 69 pence each um, from this range. So it's really good just to use, just to put them outside to keep the bugs away. And then I got this for our garden because I really liked it. It's a citronella candle that just says their outdoor living, the outdoor living collection watering can citronella. And I really love this um, watering can. I love the pattern. Oh, sorry, I haven't done my nails today. I was about to, then I've forgotten. And I just thought I'll just start the video. So yeah, my nails are a bit rubbish. Don't look too closely at my nails. Um, but I really like that. So after I've finished using it, I can put a plant in there and it'll look really pretty. Or just use it as an actual watering can once it's burnt down. But how lovely is that? So good for 4 And I think they did have some other colours, but I just wanted yellow. I think that's a lovely colour. It's kind of a bit mustardy, actually, that one. It's really lovely, though. Love that. Um, and you can feel sort of this, like, chalky paint on it as well. So really nice and i picked up some of these kids drinking bottles i got one for toby and um, a couple for our nieces so this one um yeah it's just a metal drinking bottle and it just says on the bottom um not suitable for hot liquids wash before use and in warm soapy water not suitable for microwave or dishwasher obviously and yeah it's a stainless steel water bottle and it's great because it's got the little clip there so you can clip it onto a bag you can also drink out of that bit there Glug, 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 or there's a little bit here that you could use as well so really good um little drinks bottle and i thought they're a great price for one pound 69 so that's for toby so i'll give him that and then these two are like i said for our nieces and they've got little rainbows and things on them with a pink top which i didn't show you this closely did i it's all the different it's got like computery things on saying play and credit and you win so really cute if your kids like playing computer games just quite cute anyway but yeah these are really pretty with little rainbows and stars and love the colors so three of those which are just plonk behind me and speaking of toby i've got a couple of games that we're going to be taking camping so this is a rounders set so it's obviously got the rounders bats the cones and a ball and this was 3.99 yeah, three ninety nine, and I love rounders. When I was younger, I used to be really good at rounders, and then um, as I've got older, I'm really, I'm really rubbish. But I still think I'm going to be quite good. I think I'm going to whack the ball, and then doesn't go anywhere. But I used to be so good when I was younger. But I've just, I've lost it. I've lost it. But I'll keep trying though. So I, I do love having a game of rounders, but I'm just not very good anymore. But yeah, this would be great for camping for all the kids and having fun. So three ninety nine for that. I'll practice in the garden and then i also got this for toby as well this is 4.99 so this is great for the garden or the beach um and to take camping i mentioned camping a lot this video i'm sorry I've gone on about it but yeah these are just great aren't they this kind of thing i actually love playing this you know when you chuck it up in the air and catch it i like that when you hold it and scoop it and then you've got the um like velcro one as well so toby is gonna love these so 4.99 probably could have got them cheaper actually in poundland but I've got them now. They're probably better, like good quality. So four ninety nine for that. Oh, I've got something really good here. Actually, I forgot about this. So we've got some chopping boards, and they're always in the cupboard and sort of a bit jumbledy here and there. And I thought it'd be really good to have, um, have them on the worktop so they'd be, you know, in front of you. And because they're like this in this container, they can, you know, they'll fit on the worktop and be this way and be quite invisible. So you could have, or have them. Or you could have them sitting this way on your worktop in your kitchen or turn to the size and they're there but they're sort of not bulky and you know don't take up too much room so I thought these were great and then you've got different things that says chop dice cut slice in fact I'm going to open this up I think these were 7 99 but I'll just check wooden chopping board set of four I just really like how they how they're presented and they'll go really nicely in our kitchen so that's what they look like you can see oh then then and i'll just check the price on here so i think they were 7.99 there we go yeah 7.99 four piece wooden chopping board set so really lovely they're bamboo did you say bamboo on the back have i just made that up did i read bamboo i swear i just read bamboo yeah bamboo is a natural material each product may what do you say um may vary in color I really liked the look of them. So yeah, we'll put they'll give them a wash and then put them on our worktop. And I also bought some of these fabric conditioners. They're really heavy, so two huge fabric conditioners, and they were two for six pounds, which is I think is a really good deal, isn't it? Um Lee actually bought these because he does a lot of the washing in our house. 
and there's 85 washes in each. They were three pounds each. And this one is Blue Skies. Oh, so heavy, um, three litres. And this one is Sunshiny Days, which I think we've got them coming this weekend. So I hope you get some nice weather. And then I've got a, like amazing things coming up. So some drinks and then some beautiful plant pots and the mirrors to show you at the end, I love them. So for um, camping or being in the garden, I got some of these gin tins. I do love a gin tin. Actually, they're not, these are little cocktails. So these were 3 99 for a packet of four. And these are strawberry daiquiri made with strawberry juice and Caribbean white rum. So I do love like having a gin tin if you go on a picnic or if you go to the beach, it's just really handy just to have a little gin tin, isn't it? So I got quite a few of these. So 3 99 for four, and they're 4% alcohol, 250 millilitres in each one. So I've got two, get two strawberry daiquiri, yeah, two strawberry daiquiris. So there's eight of those, I'll put here. And then these are the gin tins, pink gin and diet lemonade. These are 3 99 as well. And I think they're, yeah, they're 4% too. So I've got quite a few gin tins to keep me going because they're so handy, aren't they? So yeah, I like those. I'm sure they'll taste really nice. So yeah, lots of those at 16. I'll share them, I won't drink all of them. And I was hoping to find this Kylie Minogue wine because I saw it on Ewan's vlog, Mr. Carrington, he found some um, Kylie Minogue wine and I thought, oh, I need to try that as well because I think he said it was really nice. So there was one bottle left, it's 5 99 and it looks really nice, doesn't it? I've seen this on um, like Tesco website, but I think it's about £7.50, so I haven't got it then, but when I saw it for a bargain in Home Bargains, I thought I would try it. So this is um, Rosé and it's 12.5%. It just says Rosé 2019 by Kylie Minogue, delicate and fruity with alluring aromas of crisp sum summer berries and blossom. So I thought I would try that. So thank you, Ewan, for the, um, the tip on your vlog. Wine of the day. I'll be trying that soon. And then to balance out all the alcohol, I thought I would try some of this non-alcohol alcohol or this really weak alcohol ultra low alcohol, nature's distillery. This looks so pretty and this kind of thing, like non-alcoholic gin can be really expensive. But I think it does look really expensive, but it was only 3 99 And if you didn't fancy having a drink, but you wanted to like have something nice, you could just have this with lemonade and ice. And I'm sure it's gonna be just as nice, all that rhymes. It just says gin spirit, ultra low alcohol, nature's distillery, a premium low alcoholic gin with the classic combination of rose and hibiscus flavour Un unashamedly oh can't say unashamedly 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 low alcohol 100% divine and obviously there is still some alcohol in it's ultra low but there is still you know there's a percentage of alcohol so I wouldn't take this if you were driving just you know if you um didn't fancy having a drink or you know you just wanted a little something and you weren't driving this is probably a really good idea and I love the look of it. it looks really posh like I said and it just says Manchester Drinks Company so they make a lot of the um flavoured gins in home bargains that I've tried and they're really nice so that was brilliant for three yeah 3.99 really cute isn't it love that bottle and then oh I'm onto my favourite things actually I couldn't believe it when I saw these plant pots so I got two of them and they have some other colours but I didn't get them because I do have quite a few garden pots but I could not resist these ones if they had bigger ones I would have got them as well but these were the only size they had in this design but how gorgeous is that so they're quite like the heritage um plant pots that you can get in garden centers and they are really expensive I found a couple at a car boot sale actually they were brand new but second hand but they were still quite expensive but these were 4 99 which is so good so I think for like a heritage plant pot like this you'd probably pay I don't know, 12 pounds or 13, 14 pounds, but these were 4.99, which I think is brilliant. And the color is just, is so nice, isn't it? This is one of my favorite colors in the garden, like this sage green. It's lovely, isn't it? It just says on here, Royal Potteries. There's a hole in the bottom, so I can plant some flowers in here. And then on the little tag here, it just says, RRP 7.99, 20 centimeters. Um, and yeah, it just says handmade, guaranteed, proof, what? Frost proof, proof, guaranteed frost proof. So your frost won't, won't make it frosty. So yeah, 4 99 for each of these. They're also really quite heavy. I just love them. They had a really nice like taupe colour 
as well. I didn't get it. I think there was only one left of those that obviously sold out quite quickly. But if they did have bigger ones, bigger versions of these, can you let me know? Because I'll go back and have a look um, at some point. I love these. I love putting these on um, like an outdoor table. They just look so pretty with a, a plant coming out. Or you can cheat. If you have a vase of um, flowers, put them in a little jam jar and put the jam jar in here and then it'll look like you're growing these flowers. You know, if you buy some from like Lidl or something or you have a nice nice what are they called bouquet of flowers in your house just um put them in the jam jar in here and it's like you've grown them so i think they're just i love those they're absolutely gorgeous and then my final item i'll just take the price i just spent ages trying to find them on my receipt and they were up here at the top and i didn't see them so these mirrors were 6.99 each and they had them in white i think i've seen the white ones before but i haven't seen them in this color and i was really like happy when I saw them and I thought they're going to be perfect. So I'm looking for um, a mirror for the outside of our house, kind of by our patio next to the, the side door. And this is perfect. So here is the mirror. I think this is just so nice. It looks really expensive. And I saw one in TK Maxx quite recently. I think I did a vlog and it was 20 or 25 pounds. So this is quite similar, but I think it's even nicer. Love that. So I've got two of them because I thought I think they must, you know, they're going to sell out and I'll put one either in our house because we've got quite a few gothic features in our house. So um, I thought this would just go perfectly. And at 6 99 it's just so cheap. So I've got two of these. They had them in the white, but I didn't think they were as nice as, as this. I just love it. It looks a bit, little bit sort of distressed as well and quite metally. You wouldn't know that that wasn't like metal. So I'm doing a bit of a rubbish job of showing you, but I'll put it outside and then I can do a bit of filming at the end of this video. So just says on the back, um, home style, contemporary home trends, rustic Soho, window mirror, and it's 51 by 76 um, centimetres, approximately 20 by 30 inches. So I got two of these and I just think they are, they're just amazing. I love those. They've done quite a few mirrors that I've liked. I think I did buy another arch one, but I didn't end up um, putting that in our house. It was like not, not nearly as nice, but that went off to a charity shop um, last year i think so i love these they're going to go straight up um and they're actually a lot bigger than the one i bought before and i love it so yeah i will show you i'm going to end this video here and then do a bit of filming outside so you can see um where the mirror goes but that is the end of the video so i really hope you enjoyed it if you did give it a like and make sure you subscribe and it's so easy to subscribe you just put in your email address and then you won't miss any videos from your favorite youtubers so um yeah subscribe as well that would be lovely so let me know your favorite um favourite item in this haul I know it was a huge haul there's absolutely loads in it my favourites I think it's all I, I mean it's all great isn't it I love the chopping boards I love this for outside I think the um little drinks bottles are really cute the kids toys the um I was really impressed with the non-alcohol non or low alcohol gin I think that looks lovely the plant pots are just such a bone i couldn't believe when i saw them in there i just thought they're such a, a good quality lovely looking product and then the mirrors were just amazing so let me know your favorite out of this haul write it in the comments below and come over to instagram as well i'm kate mccabe on instagram and i've got a house account called kate's homely home and i'll link those in the description box along with them um, any videos that i've done recently as well so i do videos every friday at the moment although i'm going to be doing um going to be doing i'm going to be having a two week break so i hope that's okay just gonna have some time off youtube and maybe instagram as well i'm not sure um so yeah just a couple of weeks off to be with my family and stuff in the summer i normally have a little break in january in the summer so i'll be back in two weeks so i've got um near august or end of july i think i'll be back so i look forward to seeing you all then but have a lovely time take care stay safe and I will see you in a few weeks. But um, yeah, have a lovely weekend. Enjoy the sunshine. And I'll speak to you very soon. See you later. And the mirror is on the wall. So here it is. And I think it just looks perfect. I love it. So I've got some flowers down here, a little bush thing that hopefully will um, have some flowers on it soon. And yeah. Oh, it's got a little bit of um, a few, uh, a bit of the brick dust on there. How good is that? How lovely does that look? I know it's not an outdoor one, but I think it should be fine. I just love it. I think it looks perfect. It's exactly what I was looking for. And it's the same color as our other doors as well. So I really like that. So yeah, I just thought I'd show you the mirror outside. So I've got some little flowers and things down here and then sitting above it is the lovely Home Bargain 6.99 mirror.